My name is Scott Zona. I'm the curator of the Wertheim Conservatory, which is part of the Department of Biological Sciences here at FIU. Well, the conservatory, as you know, is a, is a glass house, and it's designed to uh, simulate sort of a rainforest. We have plants in there. Uh, we have orchids. We have anthuriums and aeroids, uh, uh, palms and lots of ferns and fern allies, uh, and then also some some uh, uh, economically important tropical plants like cacao, the, the chocolate tree, and vanilla, the vanilla orchid. Um, and we have coffee that is now coming into bloom, as a matter of fact. One of my favorites in the collection is, is um, probably it's a favorite because it just bloomed for the first time earlier this year and I was very excited about it and, and maybe that excitement will fade. But right at the moment I'm still excited about this one very rare plant from Vietnam. I uh, was in there and just thought, oh, I ought to look and see if the Aspidistra is doing anything. And so I kind of parted the ferns that are growing next to it and there was this enormous flower that looked like a big starfish. The thing must have been about four inches in diameter with about 12 arms radiating out for it, from it. The purpose of the conservatory when it was, when it was built, and, and still is the purpose, is to provide both an environment uh, where we can grow plants for teaching and for research, but also as a place where visitors can go and kind of step away from the uh, busy campus activities and find a little solitude, uh, go in there and enjoy some, uh, just some time with the plants and, and um, in fact I, when I go in there and find people in there, uh, I'm always kind of uh, interested to note that their reaction to the place when they're coming in. Uh, I notice that they're, you know, they put their cell phones away and there's a sort of a hushed quiet well, when they're in there, like almost uh, like they're in sort of a, you know, sacred place where, where they keep their voices low and they're talking with each other and, and uh, they're, you know, looking and, and, and taking in what's around them, uh, both the sight of these, this exuberant tropical foliage and flowers, but also the smell, the, the feel of the moisture in the air, uh, the smell of the flowers blooming, uh, and, and the smell of the, the decay of leaves underfoot. I think it's just, it's, a, it's an interesting place for uh, anyone on campus to come and, and, and see the conservatory and to appreciate what we have growing here. It really is um, a hidden gem on campus.